What's up everybody? So it's time to get down with wash day. So we said we're gonna do my uh, Mayo Organics. We're gonna do the pomegranate and honey line. I already kind of pre-wet my hair as you can kind of see, but I haven't done, put any products in it yet. It's just wet. So to start off wash day, of course, what's the first thing you gotta do? Gotta shampoo your hair. So we're gonna do the shampoo. My organics, pomegranate and honey line, love it. It smells so good. Only need is just a few pumps to put in your hand, like so. I guess you gotta open it first. <laughs> so, why is it not opening? Now this is crazy, in the middle of the video. What is going on? So we'll do a couple of pumps in your hand. Water dropping all over my face. And just run the product through. Run the product through. It starts to sud on its own. Make sure you don't forget the crown. You don't want to forget the crown. You don't want to forget the back. For some reason, a lot of people focus on just the front of your hair, but you got to get it all. All of your hair needs to be cleaned and shampooed and rinsed of all of the dirt, the grime, all the product that's in there, anything that could have hit it. Rona, it's like I'm just playing. <laughs> want to massage into your scalp real good. Get the scalp real good. Because people tell you that if the cleaner the scalp, the better the hair. Everything starts from the inside out. So wash it, wash my sides real good. Shampoo. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. It smells heavenly. For those who have never used the pomegranate and honey line, oh my God, the smell alone will make you buy the entire line. But it feels good, it's soft. It's conditioning at the same time. Definitely a product that you wanna get if you haven't gotten it already. So my favorite deep conditioner is of course by my organics. It's the um, Babasu and Mint Mint conditioner. Deep conditioner is so good, so good for the scalp. So I usually deep conditioner under heat for about 30 minutes. So I'll do that. And then after I deep condition and to come wash it out, I'll be back. So I'm putting in the Babasu and Mint deep conditioner all the way through. As you can see, I'm running low, but I bought some during the anniversary sale because I needed some more. I just drop it in there and rub it all the way through my hair. And I don't know about anybody else, but I like to do a detangle brush just to comb it all the way through. And I rub it in on my scalp too, once again. Clean scalp means clean hair, good hair, healthy hair. And that's the goal overall, it's just some healthy hair. So, let me rinse off some of this hair off of my hands. Cause my hair was really dirty and I've been doing a lot of scratching so a lot of it's coming out. But then I use a detangle brush and just comb it all the way through. Make sure it gets everything, get all the little kinks out. you what I look like when I deep condition under the dryer. It's comical. Cool. All right, good people. So I'm back from deep conditioning. I did it for about 20 minutes. Not nothing too bad. So the good old reveal of the deep conditioner. You can see it. Softens your hair really good. It really gets all the product in there to keep it conditioned and soft. Because for type 4 hair, it's, it's, it tends for our hair to be really um, dry naturally. But when we deep condition, it keeps it conditioned and it helps the products to stay and last longer. So as far as what I know from my hair, I can't speak to nobody else. <laughs> but it happens for mine. So we're just going to wash this out and then go on with the next step. Once again, continue to condition the product. That's why my hair was just a bump. 
So I'm gonna grab that, that leave-in conditioner, do some pumps in my hand. And this has a different consistency, a little bit and a little bit of a different color than that of the actual regular conditioner, but works just as well. So, for those of you that are just getting certain products from certain lines, get the whole line, don't be cheap. Not if you want really healthy hair or you look at people and say, God, I want my hair like that. You're not gonna get it if you're going ahead and getting certain products from certain lines instead of just buying the entire line of a particular brand. And that's what's changed my life with my L is getting an entire line. All right, so final product for wash day, and this is the custard. So this defines your curls, make it even really individual and look really good. So I'm gonna put that in. So two final steps and we're done. Now it is time to diffuse. So I'm gonna grab my diffuser, my, um, my diffuser head and gonna get my dryer and diffuse this bad boy. All right guys, it's time to diffuse. I got my curly co, diffuser head and my detangler ceramic 2000 dryer. First dryer I ever bought, so <laughs> ain't nothing special, but does the job. So I usually diffuse my hair in cold, cold air. I don't do it on heat, so I do cold. And then just get it all done. And then eventually, what I'll do is tip my head over and diffuse that way so that all the hair gets defined and dry. So I'll be back once it's done because it's going to take a long period of time. Be right back.